All right, quick out of theater thoughts. We just saw Barbarian, uh, Thursday night showing. Mike, what were your thoughts? Great movie, um, beginning to the end. I thought it was very interesting. Definitely check it out. Uh, it's hard to say that these days with a lot of horror movies these days, but uh, this one's definitely a watch. Definitely, definitely a watch. And I recommend it, and I think you guys will like it. Definitely. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, this is spoiler-free review. Um, I, I honestly loved it. It wasn't what I expected it to be, which was a good thing. Um, I went into it with pretty low expectations. So originally, we had tried to see the 945 and it said sold out. So we grabbed the bite to eat and we were like, why don't we just go because there's no way this would be sold out. And they were having projection screen issues so they couldn't you know, play it. And so we ended up getting to see it and I think we were like a minute or two late, but um, uh, this movie was wild from start to finish. It's a little bit of a slow grind, slow build there, but there's so much tension throughout. Um, it's wild, man. It's, it's just what you expect just just go into it with an open mind have fun and it's it's wild it's it's fun absolutely um <clears throat> the puzzle pieces hit like from the beginning to the end you'll always be interested in what's going to happen next um you'll be in shock you'll laugh you'll have a great time and everything makes sense the actors were awesome in my opinion um and then it all it all adds up like once you watch this movie like, we stopped watching trailers. I don't watch trailers, but yeah. I don't watch trailers. It just gives it too much information, and we want to go in there, like, let's just give this movie a shot. Because we love movies, right? We yeah. don't want to know what's going on. Well, the cast is wild. The cast was great, and I thought they all did a great job, to be honest with you. Um, I love the beginning to the end. Like, Absolutely. honestly, this reminded me of It Follows, like, that elevated horror, but just on another level yes, um yes, just definitely. just right up there with it follows just as a great great movie um like i said like we both said a lot of fun it's a good theatrical experience too to be honest with you because usually i'm not into like loud theaters and talkative theaters but this one like everybody was kind of just having one-liners and laughs with it and we had a good time with it it was a lot of fun so i'm hoping to absolutely. see this on blu-ray or 4k at least absolutely yeah i doubt a steel book i don't know who owns the rights to it but yeah, I don't mean that. I gotta may check it out. maybe a 4k i don't know we'll it's see definitely, but definitely worth you'll rewatch this movie definitely but nowadays you get what bothers me is you get these blu-rays like uh, Malignant, uh, Crimes of the Future, yes. X, yes. Uh, Men, and it just comes out on Blu-ray, and we're looking for 4Ks now. And, you know, when I, like we were talking about this after the movie, whenever somebody says physical media is dying, they're out of their mind now. I mean, we, we have a plethora of options on the market for physical media. It's too much to keep up with, if anything. Absolutely, especially this year. I can imagine what's gonna happen next year, but this year is gonna be swamped from the beginning to the end. And a lot of movies didn't even get announced yet. So you'll be surprised if, <laughs> I'm pretty sure more shocking 4Ks are gonna be like, what the heck? Yeah. Before the end of the year, definitely. Yep, yeah. Definitely. And it's good to have different labels, man, too. No, and I know this is a talked about theme a lot, is what are your thoughts on having companies like paramount especially release it on blu-ray and then you get a steel book option then you get a 4k option later with the slip cover and and then just a plethora of options i'll be honest with you my philosophy on it is you know for one you don't nobody's forcing your hand to buy it okay sure, i'm sure. a collector he's a collector we're completists we're a little bit sick we're crazy we're fucked in the head but we like to collect almost everything that's out there so we try and do that and so I'd rather have the option um, to have it all. You know what I mean? I'll buy the Steelbook. I'll buy the 4K slip if it comes out later, potentially. I did that with Dirty Dancing recently. So I don't know. My opinion, I'd rather have more options than not enough. Absolutely. Absolutely. Because back in the day, we didn't, you know, it was just a, here's your DVD, here's your Blu-ray, whatever. DVD, yeah. Now it's you get a collector's edition, you get a France edition, a, exactly. a Germany, you know, sends out editions and stuff like that. And, so, And it's, it's surprising because it won't come to the States, say, in a slipcover, but it will come overseas in a slipcover. It won't come in the States in a steelbook. You got that option overseas. Yeah. And what's good about 4K is region free and 
even Blu-rays, Region Free Player, it's not going to be hard. It's Speaking not, of, man, I still, I, I I still got to get a Region <laughs> Free Player. Uh, I need one, of course, because I love the overseas yeah. uh, movies that come Cause out. Because I'm going to be doing that um, Serbian film, oh, Raw man. and Martyrs, triple feature I would love night. to join you guys. I know, it's going to be wild, you, man. You, you didn't watch. Well, I watched one of them. You watched but, a Serbian film, But yeah. I'll rewatch it. I, I didn't watch the other ones, though. Yeah, I think the other one. I'm looking borders, forward to that. Yeah, it didn't come that out. That one yet. I heard was out of print for the last ten years in Blu-ray. It might have been, but it never got an American release. I don't it believe. Never got an Amer It's not but, even an American release this time. No, no wow. it's Umbrella Entertainment. Well, I love Umbrella. Yeah, yeah. I'm buying Blu -ray. my first movie from them. I'm still waiting for the Grindhouse video to get get it in stock. So. Yeah, um, there was a delay. Um, Again, I'm pretty sure they'll get it by. It's looking like Sunday or Monday. Oh really? Yeah, that's what's looking like. All right, so cool. Definitely look out for that. Because I definitely got to pick that up. Oh, I gotta get it right away. Looking it's forward to sell Martyrs. Out right away. Yeah. I heard that movie is intense. Martyrs, yeah, it's a revenge look, I believe. Yeah, I but yeah, I'm looking forward to that. I'm gonna do a review for sure that night. Um, it's gonna be a good one. Uh, you're definitely not gonna want to miss that one. But uh, yeah, no. Um, Barbarian was a lot of fun though. If you haven't seen it um, yet when you're watching this video, if you didn't go check it out Thursday night, go watch it, especially if you're a horror fan, if you're into anything like that. Um, it's just, it's a wild ride. Enjoy it. Just just sit there and just enjoy it. It's Absolutely. it's worth it. It's, it's, it's worth every penny. It's an experience. It's an experience, that's for sure. I mean, my jaw dropped. I was like, what the fuck in a couple scenes? So it's, it's wild. I mean, the whole theater was pretty... It's one of those theatrical experiences, you know what I mean? It's just, it's a loud theater because it's got a lot of those moments. So it's pretty crazy. Um, yeah, absolutely. Check yeah. it out, guys. Yeah. Yeah, we, I loved it. Bob loved it. Yep. Go check it out. Both of us. I'm going to give it a four and a half out of five. I did. There was one complaint and it's the way, and it, this is no spoiler, but I don't like the way the story is told, if that makes sense. I don't like the way it goes back and forth. I don't like stories where it's like, it's not quite straightforward yeah i get what he's saying they do that some they've been doing that uh for quite a little time but they've been doing that a little more recently and it's not necessarily a bad thing but it's not like a great thing where it kind of you know reverses you off track but i guess they, they do that so you can understand the movie a little more i guess yeah it's, it's pretty it's pretty wild i mean it didn't bother me in this one because it worked for me but a lot of times when they go back and forth, I'm like, eh, I don't know how I feel about that. But like I said, hopefully it's not a spoiler or anything like that. Um, but if you haven't seen it, go check it out. Um, you're not going to want to hear any spoilers on this one. Just just go check it out. It's fun. Great cast. Um, it's intense. It's, it's actually pretty scary, to be honest with you. It's got some moments where you're like on the edge of your seat you're like you know there and it's shot really well which makes it creepier because of the way it's shot so it works very well this movie was really well directed and just it just it's just a really good film so go check it out and uh we'll catch you in the next video have a go on